Canadians deserve better than having this fleet rust out, and dealing with this problem is long overdue. The Canadian Coast Guard fleet is about to get a serious overhaul. After facing criticism for letting the Coast Guard's vessels age so dramatically, the federal government has announced it's investing what's expected to be close to $16 billion to build up to 18 new ships. The ships will be built at Canadian shipyards. These new vessels will do everything from icebreaking on the Great Lakes to fisheries patrol to conducting pollution response. Most of these new multi-purpose vessels will be built in BC at C-SPAN's Vancouver shipyards. Work will also be shared by Irving Shipbuilding in Halifax. A third shipyard is expected to be announced in the coming months. So the Trudeau government chose HMCS Discovery, a naval base in Stanley Park, for Wednesday's announcement. The PM was also joined by a number of Canadian Coast Guard officers. And the Prime Minister is saying the funding, the construction and new fleet will lead to many new jobs. This fleet renewal is going to create jobs in everything from ship design and engineering to construction, welding and inspection, while strengthening this world-class Canadian industry. But will this overhaul of the Coast Guard fleet stay on budget, and when will the new ships start hitting the water? I have tremendous confidence in the extraordinary women and men who work in our shipyards across this country in their capacity uh, to deliver the excellent ships that our Coast Guard needs, and quite frankly, that Canadians need to make sure that our coasts are protected and safe for everyone. An exact cost and a concrete timeline have not been laid out yet. In Vancouver, Greg Harper, City News.